spoke to um, the demographer of the Giants this morning, he's consulted uh, with governments on this for 20 years, mm. he's consulted with this government on it. Uh, he says, if, you know, you're joking if you're telling people that taking 15,000 people a year out of Sydney and Melbourne is going to, you know, uh, make their, their commute less congested or, mm. or ease congestion on the roads. Is that really what the government's well, it would be a strange position if you were arguing, Michael, we should be cutting it by more. I'm not sure that's been uh, the Fairfax position in the past. So uh, let, let's have a look at the process that the Prime Minister's uh, got in place. Uh, he's very concerned, as we all are, about people sitting in cars, uh, taking kids to school, picking kids up from sport, uh, going to work, coming home from work. We want people out of cars and spending more time with their families, more time doing things that they want. Uh, we want to make sure that uh, the migration program is working for our country. And, uh, you know, if you look at uh, uh, sister whose funeral it was uh, today, uh, the tragedy of his uh, loss of life is, uh, uh, will be, have been remarked on by many people today. And uh, obviously everybody mourns his passing. But his, his is an amazing story of migration to this country, working hard, uh, providing for his family, uh, being a cherished part of uh, the Melbourne community. And you contrast that to the migration story of some others, uh, we should be bringing in a thousand of the people who are doing the right thing and, and reduce to zero the number of people that we bring in who are doing the wrong thing. So I think the Prime Minister's uh, spot on with the, uh, the remarks that he's made last night and the migration program in our country needs to work for us. We need to recognise that there are different demands and pressures in Sydney and Melbourne than there might be in South Australia and WA, particularly if uh, the economy in WA is, uh, is improving and the resource sector means that they can't fill those jobs with Australians. So there are a number of things that we've done uh, to address some of the concerns, uh, but I think uh, the Prime Minister will have more to say about that.